What it's like to host a Learning Council event is a, it's a really cool experience. I mean, you know, it's an honor because you have a blend of, of one of the best companies in America uh, working together with some of the best educators in America, particularly here in the state of Washington. Um, it's just a, a huge opportunity to be able to learn from them, hear what their ideas are, hear what their pain points are, uh, and really collaboratively come up together with solutions that meet the needs of kids, which is what this is really all about. One of the important pieces for these types of convenings is that we're able to share across districts or across tables and in, in different subject areas and or different schools the, the opportunity of where we are um, and really sort of gauge and reflect our practices and I think that there in the room there's a lot of knowledge that can be shared and sometimes we don't have the opportunity to be able to do that so these types of convenings really do offer that. The most valuable aspect of the Learning Council convening today was really the from, from my perspective was the, the roundtable discussion with the different groups to really be able to ask and answer a lot of the most difficult questions and all of the burning questions that most staff have in, uh, in all administrative positions. The Learning Council events um, bring collaboration. I mean, that's literally what they're designed to do. And um, they're very careful uh, when you uh, enter a Learning Council event to make sure that you have the proper blend of what uh, what solutions and what companies can bring to the table to help with the problems that uh, exist and the opportunities that exist in schools uh, to educate, as well as the collaborative learning about what's worked, what hasn't worked, and what direction educational institutions want to go. And the way that these are facilitated, it allows you to talk um, and learn both from both sides, um, both levels of presentation, and be able to come up with solutions that you can actually put into plan and start doing something versus you know still being in the dark where, where you can't take action. The best part of the Learning Council event um, is just how many people uh, are here. I mean these, these events are the right size. Um, this particular event has 47 people and every single person is bringing content to be able to share with the group. We have you know school districts that are just starting. We have uh, you know private and religious schools who are exploring what um, the opportunities are to educate their groups. You get a perspective from all of these different individuals that's unique um, and independent and collaboratively it really helps me uh, understand the total landscape of what uh, kids need and how we can help kids. This Learning Council discussion meeting has helped bring up different issues and topics that maybe people haven't thought about before, some that I haven't thought about before. Everything from cyberbullying to what, how do you vet curriculum, how do you come with a strategic plan and the differences between goals and strategic plans. It's easy to say I have an end goal of implementing technology but what's the plan to get it in place and how do you set that up in a way that you can convey it to the other people on your team so that you hold them accountable and then it comes back and actually produces change. So it's more than just saying I've got this goal, let's just jump in the deep end and put technology in there. In some cases it is, is important to jump in both feet in the deep end because if you don't try you won't go anywhere but if you have a plan you know that you'll need to adjust and readjust and make changes to that along the way. How do we train teachers to be prepared for this? How do we get students to realize that it's not just about playing with technology but it's about humanity because there's typically this idea of technology being something that's out in the distance or futuristic when it's really about the core of who we are as people and how do we get that knowledge and transfer it into something useful for society and for ourselves what do we do about that and that goes way beyond a textbook it goes way beyond content even it goes way beyond clicking buttons it goes into how do we talk to each other how do we see the needs of other people and and see what we do with those type of things the three words that would describe uh, the Learning Council event would be, first of all, it's innovative. Uh, people are bringing innovation to the table. Uh, B, it is collaborative. Uh, you know, there, there's conversation, there's hearty dialogue, there's debate, um, there's opposing views, there's people who are bringing um, items to the table for real consideration. Uh, and three, they're progressive. Um, they're, they're looking into not only what can you do now, but what can you do for the future. They're not looking uh, into the past of how things used to be done. They're looking to where the technology is at and where things are going in the future.